and welcome to this week's art lesson. Now today we're going to be learning about the artist Fayyug Ahmed, who is a Azerbaijani artist and he's interested in traditional rug making and the patterns that are on them, but also in abstracting them, in making them warp or distort in some way. And this gave me the idea to try that with our own patterns to see how we can sort of experiment with making them do things that we wouldn't normally expect them to do. So today we will need two pieces of plain paper, a water pot, paintbrush, scissors and watercolour paint. And we will begin by breaking our two pieces of paper into four. Begin by folding your two pieces of paper in half. Cut along the two folded lines carefully with your scissors. We should now have four smaller pieces of paper. Finally, have a look at these different traditional rug patterns and think about which ones you like. Prepare your watercolour paints and turn your paper portrait if it isn't already. Now start painting a pattern at the top of your first piece of paper and work your way as far as halfway down. For your second small piece of paper, do the same and this time with different colours. For your last two, think about other patterns that have inspired you this term and paint them as far as halfway down too. We're going to use the same colours from what we've painted so far to paint streaks down our paper. Begin with the first colour you started with then get some more of that colour from your paint tray. Take a deep breath in and as you breathe out paint down the rest of your page from it. Continue to do this all the way across your pattern and then onto your other artworks too. Do any of yours look like rainbows? If there is any white paper left on the bottom halves, you could cut it out. Okay, well I stopped mine there and as I was doing that I was thinking about all the different shapes and patterns and styles that we've developed this time 
And what I really like about Fagir Ahmed is that he shows that you can use a, quite a traditional style and then you can just completely break the rules and make it become something else. Now if you enjoyed that, here are three more of Fagir Ahmed's artworks. And have a wonderful week and I'll see you all soon. Goodbye.